And President Balatinubu has been commended for strengthening the educational sector through the approval for the establishment of the National Open University of Nigeria in the local government area of Plateau, while giving Nigerians, particularly from the rural areas, an opportunity to break the shackles of poverty and ignorance. Former Governor of Plateau State and current Senator Simon Lalong disclosed these while commissioning the National Open University now. Study Center Wase, a federal project conceived and attracted by the former Deputy Speaker, House of Representatives, Ahmed Idris Wase, and said the university will serve as a center of education for neighboring states like Taraba and Adamawa states. We have my, cell, my senatorial district that I remain very proud of Idris Maji. Very, very proud of him. Even when I was governor, I had cause to go there to commission so many of the projects that he did. The last project I did, I went there to commission the police, uh, the police college, very fine police college. I commissioned the police uh, barracks and I said I will go through the road that is constructed. If we have people like this in Plateau, we send and they bring back this. We don't mind sending them several years until he retires and he retires. The reason why we are pushing for education in Wase and environment, this center will not serve for only southern zone, it will, it will connect us to Taraba who are our brothers there, it will lead us to Guambi, who are our brothers there. I'm part of Bauchi. I want to believe this center is going to be helpful. Beyond the program my, 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 my VC has mentioned, by the grace of God, we shall give every support to make it one of the best in the country. The work has just started. I want to say, at the comfort of our doorsteps, inshallah, we shall write for doctorate degrees here in this place by the grace of God. We invite all stakeholders to join us and him in this journey of community empowerment and sustainable development, especially in the area of security, securing lives and property. I realize and appreciate deeply the creation of the enabling environment by the Honorable Minister, Federal Minister of Education, Professor Tahir Mamman, and His Excellency, Bob Nokale Murfong, of Plateau State in line with the renewed hope agenda of the current administration of President Bola Ahmed Tinubu.